My name is uh, Marcel Kwakkel. I'm commercial director for Genpower. And Genpower is distributor of EODF since December 2022. And we are here on site at our customer, uh, AHAC, who is uh, doing a drilling project for uh, Tenet, a grid operator in the Netherlands. And it's a special project because this project is limited by certain uh, emission uh, regulations. We are not allowed to have any NOx uh, emissions here on this site. Good afternoon, my name is uh, Guus Scheren. I'm working with AAC and uh, I'm responsible for the drilling activities within our company. For this project we chose for the hydrogen solution because of the zero emission. But on this project that was required because of the environmental uh, impact. So in this project we have synchronized three GEH2s together with a battery pack of 250 kVA and 500 kilowatt hours. So the main challenge here is that we had sufficient power to power the drilling system during the day, that they have sufficient capacity, but at the same time that we could also have sufficient peak power in case of any high demands. We worked together with a Custer Energy, who have supplied us with three containers of hydrogen. Each container contains about 280 kilograms of hydrogen by 200 bar pressure. And this allows us that in total we could store over 10,000, 12,000 kilowatt hours of energy in one storage on site. It's the first time we run three GH2's machines in, in parallel, so fully synchronized, powering the battery pack. At one time, of course, at one site, it's, it's the first time, it's new technology. It's always challenging to get things up and running, but it went very smooth, uh, mainly due as well to the controller which is from Dive that we're used to work with for in many other machines as well, that hydrogen is a perfect replacement for, for diesel. Basically, we can say that the, the setup, the preparation, but also the final operation is running as planned. Yeah, we, each time we get basically a confirmation that we're capable now of doing a zero emission powering of, uh, of whatever is, uh, is required. Today we are horizontally drilling uh, below a railway connection. Uh, it's an 800 meter crossing uh, to install uh, cable ducts on the ground for the Dutch cable grid operator tenant project with hydrogen and we are looking to do more with it. This installation for us is, uh, is new, so uh, we are learning and we are gathering information. It is more comprehensive than the usual generators we have, but we are looking into more info and uh, seeing how we can deploy them more often. The most is the fact that only water is coming out of the, uh, the generator. That's uh, impressive to see. It wasn't hard to uh, synchronize the battery packs uh, with the generators. Our uh, partner AODEF with uh, Genpower provided that for us. On this project we are working together with AODEF, Genpower and uh, Tenet and uh, that's working well at the moment, yes.